Hey guys, it's Kale again. Uh, this time I have a box from a new subscription I found from Village Hat Shop. Um, I've been kind of browsing their site here and there off and on for a couple years, but uh, they have a lot of good selection on cool hats. Um, more, I guess, formal, if you would. Um, you know, like the flat caps and the, uh, you know, outback hats and different things like that. Uh, they have a club called the Flat Hat of Month Club, so you're going to get a scally type hat um, or a driver's cap. Um, the, each month, it's $20 a month, that includes shipping if you're U.S., and they'll send you the hat and a discount code. And um, overall, uh, it looked like an interesting thing to do. I don't necessarily need a bunch of other hats, I do collect them on my own anyway. Um, but I uh, figured I'd go ahead and give it a shot, and let's go ahead and see what we have. Alright. So, open up the box. Yeah. Alright. So, first thing on top of the box looks like it is a um, baseball cap. Um, just from Jackson Hats. Uh, that is a hat brand company. It looks like the actual flat cap is also here in the box. Uh, must have just been an extra they had laying around that they wanted to go ahead and throw in the box for me. Um, pretty cool that they're thinking of me. Um, it's got the back clasp closure here so it's not fitted to size but at the same time still a pretty cool hat. Eh, just kind of a, a throw it on for the weekend sort of a thing, you know? Alright. So what they have in here is the flat cap and some sizers so it gives you a little bit extra padding if the hat isn't quite the right size you can put a little bit extra padding inside the hat to make it fit your head a little bit uh, more snugly um, and I don't usually have that problem I tend to wear an extra large sort of a hat anyway and I'm on the larger side of the extra large um, so I don't again have that problem typically all right so taking it out of the plastic We've got a nice tan brown herringbone design on the hat. It is, like I was saying, going to be a scally or a driver's cap, depending on what you like to call it. Um, ivy cap, I think I've heard them called as well. Um, some people just know them as kangas. Um, but there is that hat. It's got the little snap button in the front so you can uh, open it up. I think if you're generally just wearing it around, I don't think I've ever really left it unbuttoned for any reason. Um, I did get uh, one of my first hats uh, like this, a scally cap, uh, when I was in uh, Blarney, Ireland. Uh, they had a little Hannah hat shop there, and I decided to go ahead and grab one. Um, so I've been collecting hats for a while now, and uh, just a nice little hat. It uh, has that uh, sort of a uh, polyester lining in there. Um, the outside feels kind of like a wool, and it is a 100% wool, uh, so definitely, oh, definitely just dry clean only on that if you ever need to clean one of your hats. Um, I try to keep uh, good enough care of it that um, I don't usually have to worry about that sort of thing. Um, this hat is uh, from the Baskerville Hat Company. Um, uh, uh, these type of hats on the website usually go somewhere between $25 and $35. Um, so you're definitely getting at least your value is worth you pay about $20 a month for it again. Um, let's go ahead and see how it, let's go ahead and see how it fits. Alright. Yeah, good size already. I don't think I'll need the fillers like I was saying. Um, extra large on the large end tends to fit me really well. Um, so I think overall pretty sharp looking cap. Uh, can't complain at all about the fit. Uh, just looking at myself in the camera here and I I personally like it. Um, I've always been a fan of the flat caps. Um, lately though I've been wearing mostly just baseball caps. Uh, that's what you get a lot of um, in like the collectors. I mean it, like in the Funko boxes where I've got this one and uh, the C-3PO hat I was wearing yesterday. Um, but overall, pretty cool hat. I like the flat cap. I might have to wear it a couple more times on camera. Uh, probably wear it around. But um, get your values worth, like I said, $25, $35 hat. 
and uh, got to me for $20. Um, you also get a 10% off coupon for the website that comes with free shipping. Uh, so a little bit extra added value there, especially if you're going to buy hats um, here and there anyway. All right. Well, um, that is pretty much it. Um, the other things in the box are just uh, the discount code I was telling you about. A little... Uh, it says, hello, new member, and then it's got the discount code under my hand there. Um, it's got the invoice, and then it tells you how to use... It looks like it uh, tells you how to use the sizers. All right. Well, uh, that was everything uh, for the hat, and I uh, hope you guys liked it. I'd encourage you to go on to villagehatshop.com, get yourself one as well, especially if you look as good in these hats as I do. Um, but you guys have a great day. Thank you again.